Hello and welcome back to The Daily Eco. In today's video, we delve into the definition of a terrestrial ecosystem and explore its unique characteristics. So, let's get started. What is a terrestrial ecosystem? Terrestrial ecosystems consist of a diverse range of habitats found across the world. These ecosystems are home to organisms, both plants and animals, that thrive on the ground or in the subsoil. The flora and fauna in each terrestrial ecosystem possesses distinct characteristics, as they have adapted to their specific habitats with unique conditions. Factors such as water, solar radiation and the abundance of food and nutrients contribute to these variations. Characteristics of Terrestrial Ecosystems The specific characteristics of terrestrial ecosystems are shaped by two types of factors, abiotic factors and biotic factors. Abiotic factors encompass physical and chemical elements that determine the nature of the ecosystem, while biotic factors are related to the living organisms inhabiting it. Abiotic factors such as climate, soil composition, humidity, altitude, latitude and nutrient availability play a crucial role in determining the types of plant and animal life present in a particular ecosystem. Biotic factors encompass a wide range of living organisms, including single-celled organisms as well as larger animals and plants. These organisms have a common characteristic. They require oxygen to survive. The interplay between different species within the ecosystem and their interactions further shape their biotic factors. Together, abiotic and biotic factors influence the unique characteristics and diversity of life found within terrestrial ecosystems. Animals in terrestrial ecosystems have adapted body structures to navigate their specific environments through crawling, running or flying. These ecosystems are home to both vertebrate animals like large mammals, birds and reptiles, as well as invertebrate animals that play vital roles in ecosystem functioning. Depending on their diet, these animals can be herbivores, carnivores or omnivores, adding to the ecological diversity and balance within the ecosystem. But before we continue, let us put you to the test. How many types of ecosystems are there? Two types, three types, four types. Think about it carefully because at the end of the video you can check if you were right. Types of terrestrial ecosystems Terrestrial ecosystems exhibit a vast array of diversity and are classified based on the dominant abiotic factors and the corresponding vegetation types. The flora and fauna within each terrestrial ecosystem possesses distinct characteristics as they have adapted to their specific habitats. In general, forests harbor the highest biodiversity, which gradually decreases as we move towards other ecosystems, ultimately reaching the lowest of the lowest levels in deserts. Forests are the primary ecosystems found in the biosphere, characterized by an abundance of trees, shrubs and undergrowth. Various types of forests exist, including jungles, Mediterranean forests and subtropical forests. In contrast, scrub ecosystems are composed of low-lying vegetation, such as shrubs and small bushes, dominating the landscape. Moving on to grasslands, these ecosystems primarily consist of herbaceous plants such as grasses. They thrive in areas with semi-arid climatic conditions. Prairies and savannas are examples of grassland ecosystems. Next, we have the tundra, where trees are absent and instead mosses, lichens, herbs and small shrubs dominate the landscape. The subsoil is frozen in this ecosystem, making it prevalent in extremely cold climates. Finally, we encounter deserts. 
These ecosystems are characterized by harsh conditions, resulting in sparse flora and fauna. There are hot deserts in subtropical regions with limited precipitation, as well as polar deserts in colder regions. And going back to the question we asked you before, have you thought it through? The correct answer is C. There are four types of ecosystems, terrestrial, aquatic, mixed and artificial. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Let us know in the comments what you thought about this video and if you knew what terrestrial ecosystems were. Until next time!